Mr. Barrett Lyons, Mr. Barrett Kennedy, and Mr. Jack Allen Stoops. The referees in charge of tonight's action are Mr. Alan Wallace and Mr. Peter Lavery. So ladies and gentlemen, the stage is set. The bright lights are on. Belfast, make some noise! <laughs> the first battle of the game turns three rounds with a bad force from the weight division. It is in first, fighting out the red corner. His hands are mixed martial artists. Weight division. We've got Creven Screevens fighting out of Shaolin MMA, who was in the black and red trunks, taking on Sugar Sean McCormick, who was in the white trunks. Your third man in the cage is Mr. Aaron Wallace. This is Noel O'Keefe calling the action, as always, beside Phil Campbell. Yeah, this has all the makings of a really great welterweight matchup. Both men big for the division. Creven straight in, but just gets turned against the face or turned against the fence there by Sugar. And McCormick spent some of this camp over in Team Cabon, over in Liverpool, of course. Famous now for the likes of Terry Adam, Darren Till. And I know firsthand he was getting work in with Darren Till. He was getting work in with Mike Grundy. So real quality work that he's put in. And you're right, remember, if you were watching Clam Wars 33, Screevens was in a very close fight with Callum PC. He lost that one on the decision, the judge's decision, but came into it really in the third round. Great clinch work here from both men, and a takedown from Creven Screevens. Up against the cage, and he has McCormick right in front of his own corner as well, so... Wrist control from Sugar there, maybe trying to set up the triangle, but he's just being stacked against the cage here. Intelligent work from Screevens. Potential here though, Phil, this is... Oh, has he got the arm? We can't quite see from this position. The arm is there, he's trying to adjust now and rolls with it, but... Screevens is going to be all right and get out the back door with the arm and straight away McCormick is in on a single, Screevens needs to turn, needs to turn in. This is a real tactical battle in the wrestling, each man trying to avail of every scramble. It's almost as if Screevens has, has done his homework and, and looked at the last fight of Sean McCormick, which he ended with a devastating body shot against Stephen Cunningham. So he's seen that and he thinks that, 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 that the success he can garner will be in the clinch trying to close the distance. And a nice knee on the inside by McCormick again. And this, at the moment, is both fighters looking to get the better position and get their dominance on the fight. Good head position there from McCormick, just getting his head underneath the chin and driving that. Because where the head goes, the body follows, no. Fishing for underhooks is Screevens, but blocked. If McCormick can establish double underhooks here. But they're in that battle, that 50-50 battle for underhooks. It's one of the most draining aspects of mixed martial arts. Could be a strike-off separation here. Sugar McCormick decides. If he can just slip that hand. Aaron Wallace says, I've seen enough. Nothing happening, no advancement. I think Separates is, them. I think this is going to favor McCormick and just lands a beautiful straight down the pipe. Beautiful right hand that caught Screevens, but we have seen Screevens take shots in previous fights and he just walks through them. Yeah, he's got a granite chin, but great distance. And for composure as well. Picking the shots is Sugar McCormick. And Screevens changes levels to try and get the takedown and good defense so far. He just split the legs wonderfully there, creating such a dynamic base for himself. But even just look how calm he is. Only 22 years old and he's not rushing, he's not panicking. You see McCormick wants the separation now. He's looking at Arm Wallace as if to say he's not doing anything, separate us. You can see the pattern of the fight here. Screamers wants to get it in clinch range and try and drag it to the mat, but you can see Sean McCormick is comfortable enough and wants to stand with that kickboxing and boxing background, of course. He's happy for it to stay in the open plains, but a tough first round, exhausting first round here at Clam Wars 34. 
Wallace is clearing the cage here for the second round in the welterweight division between Creven Screevens and Sean McCormick. McCormick in the white trunks, Screevens in the black and red. An exhausting first round, both fighters grappling for position and dominance. But you could argue McCormick wasting no time as Screevens coming out throwing hell, but it's McCormick who seems to be landing the cleaner strikes thus far, Phil. You see McCormick just taking his time, trying to create a little distance, and he's happy to, he's happy to work in this clinch because he knows if there's no activity, they're going to separate and he's going to be in that striking range again. I'd like to see McCormick work the body a little more because he has such punch and power. But good work in the clinch right now from McCormick. Again, head position is perfect. Just drops his level ever so slightly and gets that head underneath the chin. He may just be creeping to try and take the back here. Both men exchanging knees in the clinch. I'd like to see McCormick change his level. And Scrivens, he just needs to be careful in the open fields here. And it is McCormick who lands a beautiful knee Big and a right hand body, to follow yes. as well. And Scrivens just turns away and an uppercut oh, is uppercut. there for days. That's it, that's it over. He Big dropped strikes. the Scrivens, just cover it up and that is it indeed, Phil Campbell. Sean Sugar McCormick Fantastic gets performance. the finish. Beautiful, beautiful work. It was the uppercut on the inside field that started it and dropped Screamins. He had to cover up and gave your referee, Aaron Wallace, no choice but to step in and wave this one off for a TKO victory for Sugar McCormick. <laughs> Two seconds of power number two. Our winner, the MTV.